Hey guys, this is Amjad. I will provide you the details how you can connect your Redmi Note 4 with your laptop wirelessly and you can do a data transfer in a very like fast manner. So for that we have, we are not using any Bluetooth stuff, okay, which is very slow. So we have some inbuilt feature in this phone which is called FTP file transfer protocol and we have this FTP server inside this explorer. So for that what you have to do you have to navigate to this explorer here. The explorer what you have to do okay before that what you have to keep in mind you should connect both your laptop and your uh, mobile I mean Redmi Note 4 to a network to a common network that means it should be in a common connected to a common network uh, you can use your um, Wi-Fi uh, it doesn't use any data you need both the device to be in same network and it is not going to use any of your data so what I have used I have connected to my network over here actually this for this uh, video I am connecting to a hotspot in another mobile but you can connect to your router or modem or whatever it is so I have connected my laptop here and I have connected uh, my uh, like uh, Redmi Note 4 also and after that what you have to do you have to open this explorer and in this explorer we have some option called FTP so once you open this FTP you can have to go to settings inside the settings what you have to do you have to sign in just give some name random name and password I think I have given us one, two, one, two, three, four. I don't remember. Maybe I will give one more time. Okay, I give you it as one, two, three, four. That's it. That's the only thing we have to do. And again, we have to start server. Once you start the server, you will get this U IP and the port number. That's it. So we are done with this mobile configuration. Now, what I am going to do. So we have to install this FileZilla. FileZilla is nothing but an FTP client. Uh, show the notes below so that you can see the URL where we, have, we can download the FileZilla client. So once you download the FileZilla client, just open it and give this IP address over here in the host part. 192, 163.154. I have copied this IP address from here. That's it. Again, what you have to do, you have to give this username. My username is Jarvis. The username you have kept here in the settings. Settings we have earlier given the username and uh, password. So password is nothing but one, two, three, four. And coming to the port, you can see the port number over here that is 2121 so port number you, you can give it as 2121 so we are done that's it let me zoom in a bit so once you have given the port number you can give it as it to connect that's it so now you can see all the folders files inside your phone so that's it you just connect both the devices to a same network start the FTP server Log into FileZilla, give these credentials, click on it. So what I will do now, I just want to copy something. I am going to copy uh, a sample file and I can show you how fast it is uh, copying. So once the folders are listed, what I am trying to do, I want to copy something. I will go to that file and I will copy to that particular location over here. It is, it is copying very fast that's it this process is very simple just drag and drop to the folder where you want to copy this file so the file will automatically wirelessly copy it to the phone okay and once you if you want to copy something back from the uh, phone 
what you have to do uh, you can just download like this that is one process you can do it will it will download to your users folder so the, this is a process we are doing to copy files between uh, uh, Redmi Note 4 and uh, your laptop wirelessly using FTP client. Sounds simple, right? So that's it guys. This is the video and even if you are seeing once I have done the copy, I can see this file over the explorer itself maybe. Let me go to the explorer. You can see the storage so I went to Explorer and I can see the storage in the storage uh, I have copied to a folder called videos maybe this one not this one videos video somewhere here okay I have copied here and it is there guys that's the way we are doing this wireless copying using ftp between redmi note 4 and the laptop so that's it uh, thank you